What is up YouTube, it's your boy Johnny A back at you guys with another video today. So we are now in the officially in the second week of January and I'm going to go over what happened with my Acorns portfolio to start off the week and I'm going to go over what happened in the S&P 500 real quick on Robinhood. So before I begin, make sure you hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. Uh, definitely leave me your likes your, and, and your comments below to help uh the video and the youtube algorithm i really would appreciate all the support and i appreciate all of you that have been subscribed since uh the beginning so um the s p 500 today actually took a huge dip earlier in the morning and we can see here today's low was at at 419 dollars and 77 cents and then eventually going back up to 428 to end the day so that's that looked pretty good to end the day back to 428 um but majority of the big tech stocks um look like they eventually got back up as well you can see microsoft apple uh tesla and google back in the green and facebook was kind of hovering around that 328 mark today but that's just a brief overall summary of what happened in the in the market so we're gonna go over to acorns and i'll show you guys how my portfolio did for monday um i do i do have more money still transferring in there so it probably you guys probably won't see it all in there yet um uh, my core account currently at forty six thousand five hundred and seventy dollars and twenty seven cents as you can see here i still got a one-time investment of eleven dollars Roundup investment of seven dollars and twenty six cents, a reoccurring investment of five dollars, which I put every week. Now my total invested is at thirty three thousand six nineteen and ninety four cents. So I'm trying to get that to thirty four thousand um, dollars. Maybe I'll hit that by the end of the month. We'll see how much more money I could throw in here. So uh, as always, dollar cost averaging and uh performance wise we actually went back down to twelve thousand dollars because i believe the all-time high was around thirteen thousand seven hundred dollars if i'm not mistaken so for the day you can see here down 158 and 56 cents for the month we are at plus 579 and 19 cents for the three months plus two thousand one hundred and forty eight dollars and fifty one cents for the six months, plus one thousand seven hundred and eighty-eight dollars and thirty-one cents, and for the year, plus six thousand sixty dollars and thirty-four cents. So we we'll look at the shares real quick, real quick on what I have: uh, large company stocks fifty-nine, medium company stocks sixteen, small company stocks at twenty, international company stocks getting close to two hundred shares. So that's pretty, pretty good as well as for the dividends because that's where i get a lot of my dividends is with the international company stocks so that's where the core account has uh finished off for monday uh you can see the last 30 days i've invested one thousand one hundred and eighty seven dollars and 28 cents as for the latest account currently at two thousand three hundred and eighty one dollars and fifty nine cents um got the reoccurring contribution of ten dollars transferring in there and performance wise plus 534 and 59 cents for the day down eight dollars and 12 cents and for the shares on the latest account three large company stocks 10 international company stocks one small company stocks and basically fractionals of medium company stocks so that's where the latest account remains and uh 50k when will i hit that on the core account um maybe by march i'm gonna give me a, a decent time time range i'm saying march um i'm hoping that the market eventually continues hitting uh new 52 week highs especially in the s p 500 and uh, for march we will get more dividends for the uh, s p the medium company stocks and as well as small company stocks so uh, I'm gonna keep you guys up to date until I eventually get there and then eventually when I hit 50k the next goal will be $100,000 so that would be pretty exciting exciting to see and I hope you guys are subscribed to follow me on this investment journey 
to be financially free one day and help you guys and motivate you guys to do the same as well. So, uh, like I said, make sure you hit the subscribe button if you haven't. I appreciate all of you guys. Hope you ha guys have a good day and I will see you guys on the next video. Peace.